phishing, ransomware, denial of service, man in the middle. You might have heard some of these terms used to describe cyber attacks, but let's put the jargon to one side for now and focus on one key question. Where exactly do these attacks come from? Well, if you've read the title of today's video, I think you can probably guess at what we're going to be talking about. That's right, it's dark web time. Now we're not talking about the deep web, which many a curious techie would have hopped on in the past to look at things that won't appear on your average search engine. No. The dark web is a different beast altogether, and it's generally the murky part of the web where hackers and organised criminals go to do business. Think of it as a cross between Nocturne Alley from Harry Potter and the Mos Eisley Cantina from Star Wars. It's not a nice place. In short, the dark web is where your passwords, credentials and sensitive data end up if you aren't following best practices when it comes to your cyber security. How do your details get there? Well, this can vary. If you've ever been caught out by a dodgy email asking for your details, boom, that's phishing. Boom, boom, boom. Ended up with a nasty virus on your PC? Again, boom. Your contact details could have even been scraped from publicly available sources, like your company's website, and added to a target list. But before we talk about what you can do to protect yourself, you're probably wondering, why should I care? Well, in the UK, in the past few weeks alone, ransomware hackers stole over 70 terabytes of sensitive data from the NHS, including passport details and confidential emails. And that's just one incident among the thousands and millions of cyber attacks happening in the UK and across the globe every single day. Schools, businesses, healthcare, everyone's a target and criminals are getting smarter. So protecting your data has never been more important than right now. Okay, so what can I do to protect myself? Well, there's the basics that you should already know if you paid attention to your company's security training videos. Ah. Uh, <laughs> Let me just throw that in like, ah. Did you pay attention? I don't think you did. Uh, things like making sure you don't click links in dodgy emails or open suspicious attachments, not using unknown USB drives, and making sure that your system is up to date with the latest security patches. But if you really do want to stay one step ahead of the hackers, you might want to take a look at making use of a dark web monitoring service. Simply put, dark web monitoring does what it says on the tin. It's a tool that checks the dark web for any signs that your credentials have been exposed by scouring millions of sources like botnets, criminal chat rooms, and peer-to-peer -peer networks. And if it finds anything out there that matches your data, you'll be alerted straight away so that you can do something about it. It really is that simple. What's a, what are the finger guns? <laughs> pew, pew, pew. Oh, on top of this, a good dark web monitoring tool will also help you to identify where you're being compromised in your organization. So for example, if your employees are continuing to get caught out by phishing scams, you know that you need to put more effort into training your users. So how can you try this for yourself? Well, this one's easy. Talk to us. We've been around the block for a while when it comes to keeping an eye on the dark web. And over the years, we've helped many of our customers to protect their data through our dark web monitoring service. The best way to check it out is with a demo. And if you click the link in the description, you can book in for a free overview with our CEO, Joe. Or if you can't wait until then, we've got a video on the channel, which you can watch here, that gives you a whistle-stop tour on our dark web monitoring solution. So there you have it. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, drop us a like, drop us a comment, let us know. We'd love to make more videos like this that are actually gonna be helpful for you and not just waste your time. In the meantime, we hope you stay safe while online and thanks for watching.